Hello everyone, welcome back to another video on my YouTube channel. So, as you can see by the title and the thumbnail, we need to talk about the new Royal Ween update. I know that a few YouTubers have made a video like this as well, and I just thought that I will make a video explaining my opinion as well on it, even though it's like pretty much the same. And yeah, we just really need to talk about it. We really need to have a chat. So, I hope you really like my outfit of the day. I'm matching with the hubby. I'm matching with Bay. Looks pretty cute. Um, so the Royal Halloween update got released, right? And don't get me wrong, we're all happy with like Wickery Cliffs. We've got Blackwood Manor, you know, like per usual. Like, oh my god, the, the flying animation looks so silly. Help. Uh, I might need to reset. Oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, I need to keep my cool, man. <laughs> Jesus Christ. But it got released. We've got our trick-or-treating. We've got ghost hunting. We've got the new school being decorated for Halloween. Got the new Halo. And two new items. And a maze, which is just a different maze, but the same prize. So, when you kind of think about it, nothing is really new. So, this update came really, really late. So, this update came on the 16th of October and it's extended till the 15th of November. I really think it should stay until at least the 20th, but that's just me. But, all right. Oh my God, the walking star! Look at the walking animation! I, I can't get over it. I'm so sorry. But, there's that. And, it's just a bit of a shame, this update. Like, I'm a bit let down. Like, don't get me wrong. I'm very, 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 very grateful. But there's just a few problems. I mean, I know rendering takes time. I know it takes a lot of time. I know it takes, like, absolutely ages. I had my best friend, Ethan, explain this to me. And he explained it quite well. Uh, apparently, his boyfriend does a bit of rendering. But not on the level of Royal High, I think. But... It's like, it just takes long, okay? It just takes, like, a long time. And ugh, this, this bundle, I actually can't with this, man. Oh. But it just takes ages. And the new school got decorated for the Royal Halloween season. Like, it's all spooky. It's all cute. You know what I mean? Like, all haunted. Yeah. But that's pretty much the only like drastically new thing you know what i mean for example in 2021 the drastically new thing for that royal halloween update was rickery cliffs and blackwood manor like that was a drastically new thing you know what i mean for example in i don't know 2022 the drastically new thing was the goddess of triumph set like, we need, like, a drastically new thing. And this isn't really drastically new. It's just new. Because, I mean... Like, it's gorgeous. And it's stunning. But more people are going to be in this area, farming candy. I know that you can get candy in the new school, but only from candy bowls. Another thing that's pretty awful is the apple bobbing situation. I know that it's to stop exploitation, which is really good, but only 10 per hour. Are you serious? So you can only get 10 apples per hour, which means 150 candy an hour. Don't get me wrong, 150 candy is good, but, I mean, that's, that's pretty bad. Like, come on, man. This is awful. This is absolutely ridiculous. I know you have to stop exploitation, but I've heard of games that put in like a little thing that detects auto clickers or something hard to make it an auto clicker. Can't you put that in? Like, can't you put that in? Like, I, I don't understand. I don't really feel the need why you need to limit this for everyone else. But another thing that is a really, really, really big shame is the item situation. In total, we've had three new items this year. Three. And I'm going to go through you with them now. So, 
Apart from the halo, we've gotten three new items. Yeah, three. We've got the candy bag, which is 10,000 diamonds for some reason. And I'm not going to be getting that until it's lowered in price, man. Like, I ain't going through that. And this too cute for school shoulder bag. It's cute, but I don't think many people are going to be wearing that. That's the problem. With the bag, however... Oh my god, it looks like it's eating my bum. Oh my god. With the bag... <laughs> With the bag, however... This is so broken. I'm sorry. I can't do this, man. There's, like, lots of toggles, but this is the first time in Royal High history that we have to pay for a candy bag. Are you, are you for real? Are you dumb? Sorry. Language there. Sorry, I just got a little bit angry. But... A candy bag is supposed to be like a memory, like a badge, for example. Think about it this way, devs. Would you want people to pay to get a badge to say you've celebrated Royal Halloween 2022? A badge has, like, a badge has, has no pretty much purpose. It's just there in your journal. Like this candy bag, it has no purpose. It can't do anything. It's just there in the game. Like, you can just hold it. Like the Halo, for example. But that's just ridiculous. Why does a candy bag cost? That's such a shame. Another thing that's a really, really big, big shame is the maze. So, the maze. The maze was like 10 times harder this year. Lance even said it was going to be this way. Oh my god. Uh, I actually managed to complete it. If you guys want a tutorial, I'll see if I can make one. Yeah, super scary maze. I did it with Winley. Uh, Save so these changes. But I did the maze, right? And it was relatively, it was relatively hard. So it was definitely different. But so like they changed the actual maze, but they didn't change the prize. Now, if you still haven't completed the maze and you don't know what the prize is. There's pretty much no spoilers for you. It's the same as last year's with the steampunk wings and 2000 candy. This is a big shame, okay? I am so upset by that because people spent hours and hours and hours trying to do this maze because there were no tutorials out at the time, only to find out it's the same prize as last year. They could have at least made the prize like 5,000 candies. Like, at least... Or maybe 5,000 candies in the candy bag. Maybe that. It could just be that. Why not? Why? That's ridiculous. I feel like Royal High's definitely wasted our time doing that. Because if it's so easy to make a whole new maze, then surely it's easy enough to make a prize that's different from last year. Like, I'm sure that's going to be easier, man. I'm sure... But this update, is, it's quite a shame. It's quite the shame. We've only got two new items, excluding the Halo. The Halo is bog standard. Like, we need that anyway. And the Halo isn't even going to be here for long, because then we've got Christmas. We've got some new locker doors, but they're 10,000 candies each. You get 250 candy an hour. Ethan got this, my best friend, also my mod. And he said that they're good like he said that they're good so you guys can get that if you want but this will only be available during the evening call season when you get the candies so that's a bit of a shame but <sighs> just woke up sorry <laughs> but it's just ridiculously expensive why does everything have to be so many diamonds or candies we've got no new sets no new wings only two new buyable items, one of them shouldn't even be buyable. And a halo, which is already skyrocketing in price. I know that this happens with every single halo, but I've seen someone, I've seen a screenshot of a trade, someone trading 10 million diamonds for it. Chill. Chill. There's still like five weeks or six weeks to get it, okay? Relax. Relax, okay? This doesn't need to be a thing. Overpricing in the Royal High community is definitely the Royal High community's fault, not the developers. But that's just insane, because we've had no new items for so long, when people get excited a new one gets released, then they overprice it, which is apparently the community's fault, not the devs. So 
Though I'd kind of say that the overpricing is the dev's fault in a way. If there's a phase when loads of loads of items come out and they all get overpriced, then that would partially be the Royal High community's fault, but also partially the developer's fault, because everyone's getting so excited that new items have just been released that they can't wait to get them, so they overprice them. This update is a big shame, honestly. I'm very, very disappointed. Like, don't get me wrong, I'm still going to play it, I'm still going to have fun with my friends, I'm still wanting to make videos in here, get screenshots and memories... But this is a big shame. This is a really big shame. We've practically got nothing new. I understand that I might sound ungrateful, but there isn't much to be grateful for when you think about it. Like, there isn't much to be like, oh my god, this update is beautiful, oh my god. Don't get me wrong, it is. Like, it's absolutely stunning, but we could have had more. I don't understand why it needs to be so late. I really don't understand that. But, yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say. So, please let me know your thoughts on it. Overall, I'm just not very happy with this update, man. Like, I'm not the happiest. But let me know your opinion on it. This isn't hate towards the devs whatsoever. I love the update, but I just think we could definitely have more. Because we've definitely been left. You know what I mean? But, yeah. That's pretty much it, really. But thank you for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. Make sure to like, comment, share and subscribe. Make sure to join my Discord server. The link is in the description. If it doesn't work, then make sure to friend me. And I will see you next time. Also, for the next giveaway I'm going to be doing, it's going to be another donation giveaway. So whatever you guys donate, it will be in the giveaway. So, for example, if someone donates... Goddess of Triumph sleeves, they'll be in the giveaway. So, like, that item will be given away, for example. And it will all be given away at once as well. All users and credits will also be said throughout the winning video. Goodbye!